Hi, this video is from interview.com. Interview.com is a job portal. In this video, I'm going to talk about one of the basic spring framework interview equation. What's the difference between CG lib proxy and JDK proxy? Spring's AOP aspect or inter programming is proxy based. That means when I try to get a bean, it'll when I try to get a bean from the container, it's not going to give me the real object, it's going to give me the proxy object. When you debug and see the, the, the bean that has been, the object that has been written by the spring container will be of type JDK Denway proxy or CGLib proxy. So now in this video, I'm going to talk about the difference between these two proxies. Spring provides two different options to create proxies. One is based on JDK dynamic proxies and, and it works with interfaces and the other one utilizes CGLib and is based on the classes. JDK dynamic proxy can only proxy by interface. That means so your target class needs to implement an interface which will also be implemented by the proxy class. See for example I have I uploader and file uploader. This is my target class. So now a proxy class will be created from this interface so proxy class will be created by the spring framework which will al also implement this interface and what will happen is it will create the wrapper methods and wherever the weaving has to be done it will it will be done by the spring framework whereas cglib can create proxy by subclassing in this scenario the proxy becomes a subclass of the target class whereas here a proxy class will directly implement here the proxy class will subclass from the target class. So this is the difference between JDK dynamic proxy and CGLib proxy. Hope this video is useful and informative. Thank you and all the best.